and welcome back to the channel and another episode of the sims 3 with my favorite sim family the benton family and yes guys you see that i am actually in the build mode what i'm doing right now is i am actually uh preparing the family for a few festivities that are going on right now um First off, for some reason, the girl's birthday, which I'm so excited about, their birthday is today, and it happens to be on Spooky Day. And so, um, when I came into gameplay, I totally was like, who's at the front door? And it's some really cute kids outside with really, really cute costumes. Um... <laughs> for the um, festivities of the uh, very spooky day. And this is actually Felicia Santos. And if you guys have been watching my channel, you guys know that Felicia actually was one of um, Shawnee's uh, daycare kids um, back in the day. Um, so hopefully um, what I'm gonna try to do um, and this little girl, what's her name? I think I created her too. This is, yeah, this is um, Emma Marquez. So what I want to do is I'm going to actually try and um, hopefully I can keep the kids here. That's my plan. Um, but they actually came for treats. And this one over here, I think this is... Um, the little burglar. This is actually, I think, yeah, Sophia Santos. And so the, these um, girls um, were actually daycare kids of Shiny. So kind of fun. Um, and um, basically what I'm going to be doing um, or what we're going to be doing in this episode is we're going to be growing up both the girls. I'm so excited. Um, this is something I just put in here because what I'm going to do is they're going to have like a Halloween themed birthday. Um, they're pretty little, so I'm not going to really go overboard with, um, you know, anything else. Um, I was going to bake a cake, but I think this will be much easier. Does it fit on there? No, it doesn't. So we probably will have to still bake a cake, I'm thinking. Or I can put this on the counter in uh, the kitchen. But yeah, so the girls are going up today, and so I wanted to do a little bit of this. So I put this here. I think that's all I'm going to really do. Um, what I'm going to try to do is I'm going to have right now, I'm going to have Jalen, I'm going to have Jalen get onto the computer, well, the telephone. Maybe we can keep these girls here. So we are actually trying to introduce ourselves um, to them again. Shiny already knows them. But I want them to, it would be kind of cute to have them at the party. I don't know if we're going to be able to pull this one off. Yeah, invite everyone in. Yeah. All right, so let's see how this all plays out. It would be really nice um, to have the girls here when um, when Alana grows up. Um, like I said, I want them to kind of grow up with friends. I, I was wishing for, like, a boy or something. So I've actually been... Um, Oh, I think they're leaving. Are they leaving? I think they're leaving. Yeah, they're like, it's too cold out here. Give treat. All right, so they left. So no big deal. Um, What I'm going to do, let's see, where is Jalen? All right, so Jalen's upstairs. Let me see here. Um, oh, my God, guys, you do not know how many times I've had to restart this game. I've been having so many issues. It's been so crazy. Follow up with patient, phone settings, um, uh, throw party. Let's see if we can throw a party. And if I can, hopefully those girls will be there. Hopefully the girls will be um, someone we can invite. Um, let's see. Okay, I know. Oh my gosh, you need to clean that toilet for real though. Alright, so let's see here. Um, let's have him call. Okay, now he's at the point of being pissed off tired. I always hate that part. Alrighty, so, um, a birthday party. Um, if the kids, okay, so Sophia is there, and, um, okay, cool, so he knew both the girls. I don't think they know, oh, and Emma. Yeah, hopefully we can get the girls to come back, and then we're gonna also invite some of, um, some friends that have been like lifelong friends for them. So we're gonna invite them over. I've been really bad with that, so I'm hoping, um, once I get all of the kids kind of in a cool place, we can start having um, more and more um, kind of activities, like adult activities. So that would be kind of cool. Um, why is it not letting me save this? Select, oh, select the clothing type. 
so they can just come in casual wear it would have been nice for costume i was going to try to do costumes but i don't know what's going on so yeah the party's going to be going on in about an hour so i'm going to have Jalen um come over here and he's going to sleep oh my gosh is he thinking about another woman did you see that like for real though all right so um the girls left so i don't know what you i don't know what you're waiting on they left um already so yeah they left us so the party's gonna start in an hour and i think she's happy about it too look at it she's like yes all right so you need to come in out of the rain dashing to pay some bills is this true yeah uh pay bills so go ahead and pay the bills um yeah so she'll go and do that and the girls are actually also getting a little fussy yeah dad couldn't even take a nap all right so yeah um what is she doing with her being carried she is so spoiled i cannot wait to grow this little girl up she's been fun but it's been real but we want to we want to definitely grow you up now all righty um yeah so the everyone should be arriving oh my gosh everyone is actually coming already so let's go ahead and do this um let me bring down the walls and um why don't you go ahead and serve go ahead and serve some food here i would have um put them some costumes on but i just hadn't put that together no i didn't what is this guy doing here i don't even think we invited him what is shiny doing she's like can i get in oh and they even brought food that's cool they, that, that's definitely cool all right so yes everyone's coming by for the birthday party i'm so excited so she's gonna hurry up and finish um shiny is actually decorating the cake as we speak so cute how cute is that oh i know don't go don't go don't go i told you i knew it i knew it disastrous birthday as usual all right so let's see let's have shiny um start this off yeah all the, the young girls they left oh well no big deal um so yeah so we're going to be growing up alana first all right so alana's birthday all right so hopefully the rest of everyone else stays and no one goes like no one else should leave right now but yeah so this is cute oh look at it oh look at this it's so sweet so sweet like i said this is Jalen's good friend i'm gonna really try to start playing with them more because it was so fun it's always been fun all right so yeah um let's go ahead and um grow her up look at the mom look at alana she's like can you please let her down i need to grow her up like really quickly all right so yeah so let's go ahead and speed it up everyone's getting hungry and it's time it is finally time to grow her up all right so yeah all right okay if dad would not come with us so we need him to come with us and um i always hate they do it right in this small space it's always hard look at her she's like taking out her trash i know she's like you dirty dumps you <laughs> thank you ariana we are messy we are very messy but when you have all these little kids it's hard to oh my gosh like really she takes this freaking stroller everywhere this is like taking forever hurry up all right so let's let's get uh Jalen here go here hurry hurry let's get everyone around he should be taking videos of this but i don't know how that's gonna work really i don't know okay all right so this is the only good view shot i can get it always looks so weird like this maybe i'll do it from this way well, we definitely be taking pictures of it oops look i'm telling you guys like let me pause the game like i always mess up right here and i'm like oh my gosh i'm not getting the right picture all right so i'll get this view i think this is the best view to have um come out a little more and um yeah this is the best one now dad let's see we want him over here um record home video all right so i don't even want him to worry about that just do what i need you to do all right so, so he's he's all excited and everything which he, which his baby girl is growing up so let me see oh my gosh oh my gosh okay i think it's recording i think it's recording everything oh my gosh she's growing up guys oh my gosh i'm so excited oh how cute is this move out the way shiny yeah oh my gosh she looks cross-eyed oh my gosh poor little thing oh she's adorable come on this is taking forever i'm so excited like i'm she was given 
you know, she gave birth to her inside the game. So it's almost kind of almost like a treat. It is so awesome. There she goes. There she goes. Alrighty, so what does it say, guys? With crawling and cribs behind her, Alana has finally gotten on her own two feet and become a child. Alana has lots of school and homework ahead of her, but if she studies hard and keeps her grades up, she will be well on her way to success. Due to your excellent parenting skills, you may not you may now choose a trait for Alana to develop. So that's cool. Loving it, loving it. All right, so she already was an athletic, and she's a genius. So she's kind of like that tomboy kind of genius type, so I'm kind of nerdy little girl, which I love. Um, what are some of the other things that I would want her to have? Um, animal lover. I think that would be kind of cute. Like, yeah, so I'm going to have her be an animal lover. Yeah, because she has the pets. They've been with them forever. I think that would be really cute. Like, maybe she'll become, I don't know, loving animals, doing something fun with animals. So this is so cute. Look at her. All right, so we're going to actually, so why don't you go ahead and hug her, Dad? So Dad's going to go and hug her, friendly, um, and more. Um, look, a lot already got a piece of cake. She's like, whatever, Dad. So that's kind of good. I'm glad that she's grown up. Definitely glad, for sure. It's Vivian's birthday. I don't even think it's going to wait for Vivian. She doesn't eat cake anyway, right? So it's time for Vivian to grow up as well. Um, too bad we weren't able to play with Vivian as a baby too much. Well, I'm not really sad about it because it's so hard with them being little like that. So, yeah. All right, so... Um, Dad, you need to go upstairs. Why does that always happen? It does, it always seems to happen that, you know, us as parents, like, we always pay attention more to the little, to the youngest one. I mean, the oldest one, rather. But anyway, the days have flown by, and Vivian is now a toddler. Um, she still needs a lot of caring for, but can now also learn basic sim skills, like walking and talking. What she learns at this age will set the stage for her future development. Aww. So Vivian is now um, a toddler. How cute is this? Okay, so I'm going to have um, Dad. Where is he? He knows he's the video taker, so he needs to come here, go here, and um, yeah. So we'll just get like a real, a real simple picture with um, with Vivian, and I'm gonna actually go into create a sim, and uh, we will do um, yeah. But he needs to come here like really quick, so we're gonna do that and create a sim. We gotta hurry up too because I know that um, record home video. Oh my god, I forget. He's going to be looking the other freaking way. Alrighty. Oh my gosh, it's kind of like a weird... That's not going to work. Alright, so you need to come like right here. Go here. Alright, so we have him go here. So he'll take the video of baby girl. Alright, so go here. Turn around. This is so annoying, but I love the videos. Go here. And then turn around. Go here. <laughs> this is annoying. Like, for real, though. All right. So, now you do the video. Go record home video. All right. It's still, like, at the top of her head. But why not? All righty. I just wanted to get, like, a picture of her. Yeah, that's perfect. Yeah. Like, look at her. She looks weird a little bit in the face. Don't you think? <laughs> I don't know. But this is Vivian, guys. Vivian Benton. She's now a toddler. Hey, girl. Hey, mama. <laughs> All right. Yeah, she looks a little weird. Anyway, yeah. So, um, let me go ahead and finish that up. And then he can actually record it and everything. And we'll be able to watch it on our home video. So, it'll be kind of cute. All right. So, Men's is outside, like, uh, so pissed off. Like, he's like, will someone care for me? Like, what's his deal? Like, what's his problem? Sleep here. All right. Go ahead, Mittens. Why does he look still? Like, is he dead? What's wrong with Mittens? I know. Doesn't he look weird? <laughs> Poor Mittens. All right, so let's see. Um, all right, so, yeah, so it's like 2.30 or 3.30 in the morning, and it is crazy again around the Benton household. So what we're going to do is we're going to, um, I am going to actually take them in to create a sim individually. What is she over there for? Please tell me she's not pregnant. Did I get her pregnant? Oh, my gosh, she should be pregnant. At least I don't think so. I guess the cake made her sick. Okay, clean that. Oops. I'm all taking pictures, yeah. Go ahead and clean that. Um, they need to really clean up around here. And now that, um, let me look, get another look at her. Like, she's sleepy. Yeah, I know, girly. I know. All right, so we're going to actually have, um, we're going to have them clean up, get everything kind of situated, and then 
command to guard. Like, why? Clean up. Um, clean up. I, I love an extra pair of hands around here for sure. So she's going to start helping. <laughs> she can start helping clean up around here. Right? So she can help a lot. Yeah. So, yeah, what we'll do in this, um, the remainder of the episode is we will um, go ahead and um, I'm going to do a makeover, probably over everyone, uh, real quick makeovers. And then we're going to um, go ahead and um, also make over her room because they actually need a room that they can actually... Um, all that the two girls can actually sleep in so we're gonna do that as okay well. guys so this is Alana's everyday look um I decided to go with um a very cute schoolgirl look um kind of sort as if she was in private school because it kind of sucks in the sims 3 they don't have the private school um interaction with the headmaster so this is what I picked for her for her everyday look I simply adore this and if I had a little girl I definitely would dress her like this I love this look definitely love this look so this will be her everyday look and I put a little a little bit of makeup on her not a lot but I did put a little um put her some cute little little diamond earrings and she looks so adorbs um and i love this look definitely love this look i love little girls to look just like little girls and alana looks beautiful so that's her everyday look and um this is her formal look um <laughs> this is her formal look and in her formal look i definitely love like i said i love little girls to be little girls so i love lots of floral and i love little headbands and braids and pigtails and i think this is just a cute little look here and I did forget her earrings. Definitely did that. But we'll do that a little bit later. But this is her every this is her everyday look, guys. This is her everyday look. And then um this is going to be her sleepwear. She's really funny little girl, I figure, and she's very she's almost on the verge of just being you know, a girl that loves to do just about everything. She loves, if you notice, we have her loving, you know, animals and she loves sports and she loves to learn. So she's just a different little funny little girl. And I think this is a cute little bedtime outfit for her to to go to sleep in. And um, for her athletic, this is her athletic wear. Um, very sporty look, um, yet girly with her little baseball cap and her little, this reminded me of oranges, but I think it's daisies. But I love it, love it, love it. And I so miss the color wheel. Can they definitely bring the color wheel back? I love this look on her. And this is for her athletic look. And for the swimwear, um, really cute. She almost looks like she's a gymnast in this. Um, but yeah, so I went with this look for her, um, swim wear. And they have a pool, so we'll definitely be getting her in the pool, and she'll be learning how to swim really soon. Um, and then for her, for her outerwear, let's see, what did I go with? I went with this. I thought this was super cute, and I had her a matching coat and matching uh, rain boots that she has on, or snow boots, rather, and she's got a really cute little beanie on. I think this is adorbs for her, and yeah, so that's what I have her on. Didn't really change anything else for her, um, and then what I'm going to do now is I'm going to show you guys what I did to her little sister, Vivian. I love that name, Vivian. Um, it's really rich and pretty. See, she looks really cute. I love that look on Alana. She is so adorable. She's so cute, cute. Mm. <laughs> All right, so let's go. Let me show you guys what I did to um, baby girl here. I'm going to just go into... Um, Let's see, does it allow you? Oh, there it is. So I'm going to show you what what I did to her. It's a little bit easier to show it in um, Create a Sim. All right, so this is a baby girl. I think her eyes are freaking gray. She is so cute. And I love the little ponytail knots. I think that's adorable for her. Um, and yeah, I don't know who she really looks like because I don't think I gave either one of them gray eyes. That's her parent that is uh, Jalen and Shawnee. But I still love the look and she looks adorable. Just a little jean jacket, little jean outfit with um, a little jacket to go with, a little vest. And for her other clothing, not much for the toddlers. Um, her formal, just kind of, just something a little, something to romp around in. Um, nothing big, but it's still cute to me. Um, and um, what did I do? I did this for sleepwear. Let's see. I did the little, I did the little fish scene for the sleepwear, and um, for her outerwear. 
She's got this cute little um, kind of snowsuit jumper on. She is so adorable. So this is this is Vivian's look. So she looks super cute. And for her aspirations or whatever, she's clumsy, which is a little different. So she's going to be a little more awkward than sister. And she's also, she loves the outdoors. So that's cute. So she might be, you know, this outdoorsy type sim. I'm not sure yet what I'm going to do with her. So these are just some of the things that she likes. And um, she is an Aquarius. So she's super cute and I can't wait to see her blossom into a teen and go on further than that so that's cute so I know we got like two girls so I know that Jalen and Shawnee really really soon maybe even in this episode we will be wanting to actually go ahead and um turn that baby you know maybe have another baby so they might want to go ahead and rompy romp back into the bedroom again so what I wanted to do guys I wanted to do a little bit of some changes in the bedroom here because I could do a few things um, and I think I'm not gonna do too much I could knock out this right um, but I do want to give sister like her own room but I still feel like they're both young I think when um, I don't know hmm I mean the way that I have the room set up I guess I could actually give this away and the parents what I'm gonna do um, hmm I'm actually gonna I know what I'm gonna do I'm gonna take all of this out and I'm actually going to move let me see do I have any other kind of uh, kid bedding what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually I'm not ready for that other part I'm not really ready to give a new room um, for Alana right now but I'm gonna do this I'm going to actually put I love this crib it fits perfect so I'm gonna do this I'm gonna put this crib in here and this is going to be baby Vivian's side of the room um, yeah cuz I don't want to really I want to kind of keep Alana's room so I think we already have a lot of this so we can actually get rid of this so we can actually uh, we can get rid of it and um, we could put maybe one of these downstairs so she doesn't have to deal with it so we could put that there can I delete that okay we can't delete that but we need to delete it it's probably bad food by now all right back in here so yeah that's what I'm gonna do um does this come in wood the changing table oh it does come dark I probably originally oh no but not the darkness that I was looking for We'll put that over here and then we will go ahead and make this um, let me see. trying to see what color this will come out to be and I definitely like oh, okay that that does match to me it matches enough I love this look um yeah in the parents their room is dark so that cherry wood look um, is actually perfect we'll go with that I love that look and then we will go with that yeah cool alrighty can we change this too yeah I don't know I'm so I have to have everything uniform <laughs> so we had that look so that'll go perfectly in the room um, let's see oh my gosh they need to clean that bathroom for real um, hmm. We'll go with this. Move this around here. That'll be her little potty that she can use in the bathroom. Or, you know what? Actually, we could just put it over here. Why not? Yeah. Alright, we'll do that there. And all of the other stuff, like these things here, that's actually, we already have that in the playroom area. That That's actually a garage, or used to be a garage. Um, this is actually kind of cute. And I could actually kind of maybe keep this in the room so she could actually eat in the room rather than disturbing mommy and daddy in, in the morning. Maybe. Nah, I don't really like that. Alrighty, so if I pull up the walls, I want to see how... Oh, I hate this thing. Why does it do that? And I think it's going to take me back into... I don't know. I give up. We'll have to look at see how that looks later. I give up on that. All right, so we'll go here and um, we'll just put in a lighting over here, like that. Um, yeah, or we'll go with this one. 
How about this one? Yeah, just a basic light. Just a basic light right there. And, um, yeah. I think this will work. Can we put a little bear or something in here? Yeah, that'll be perfect. I'm hoping we might be able to get this, um... Okay, cool. So we're good with that, right? We're good. All right, so that looks great. I think it looks good. I like it. I don't know about you, but I like it. All right, so let's... I'll do one more thing. I'll make this brown. We can make it a purple potty. A really deep purple potty. Yes, so we'll do it that color. Cool beans. And then we'll do it like, yeah. Yeah. Love it, love it, love it. Um, Let me see. Oh, yeah, this butterfly thing... Therefore, they can let her out on here when they want. Um, let me see. Does it come in the darker colors? What do we got here? Um, do like a deep purple. Yeah. Or, that would be cute. I, I don't know. I'm so much of a matchy-matchy person. No, that is not what I was looking for. But it is a cute pattern. Definitely a cute pattern. We'll keep it. I just want that dark purple that's actually in here. Go a little darker. Yeah, I want that dark. Yeah, that looks cute. I love that. Okay. Maybe switch it around just a little bit. Like, as such. Boom. Cool beans. Alright, so her room is done. Um, I wanted to do something to the walls, but I have so much a hard time. Cut up, cut away, change wall, home in. Oh, home end. All right, let me look on my. Duh, never knew that. Now I do. Sometimes you gotta follow directions. All right. Oh, this is cute. It has like a little mirror. We'll keep that mirror there. Can it? Yeah, I'll keep the mirror. That way, when she's changing her diaper, the little baby, she can, little Vivian can look in the mirror. That'll be so cute. Now, what do I need to do here? Um, let's see if we can put something on the wall though. What can we put on the wall that's still cute and kind of baby-like? Um, what is this? Oh, no. No, those are all from Showtime. We don't want that on the wall. What is this? That's kind of weird. I don't know. Hmm. Uh, I don't know. I don't know about that either. Oh, what is this? That's kind of cute, but I don't know what it would represent for her. Like, she'd be like, why do I have this in my room? Um, I think I'm going to leave it the way it is. I think I'm going to leave that the way it is, but that's, yeah. So we finished there. Now the next piece is to try to do something to this room now that, um... Alana has gotten older. All right, so we're gonna get out, get rid of all this stuff. I'm not gonna do a whole lot to it, but um, I do want to make it look a little bit more. Let's put this stuff in here. The little toys going on the ground. Yeah, we're gonna. Yeah, she deserved the big room, right? She's a big girl, so she deserves the the big room. So I love to look at a lot of the different themes that I had for the kids already. So. Um, there's so many things that I could pick from. Like, I could even go with, um, we could go with, like, the castle theme. This is actually cute. And, um, Alana could actually use this, invite friends over, and she'll already have, like, a bed that her friends can come and sleep in. So I am a big fan of, um, I'm a big fan of bunk beds, for real. That's another, well, that's not that cute. Um... We can go for the nautical look. Um, this is, I think this came with a certain look, but this is actually something else. And to be honest with you, I'm just kind of noticing, like, uh, we don't have a lot of money, so I got to really be careful. Um, they have, I have a car bed in here. So it's lots and lots of things that we could pick from, but I think I'm going to go with, um, let's see. Because I have to stay within budget also. What is this? Oh my gosh, I like that. It's like a princess looking bed. I like that look. Huh. I definitely like that. It's so princessy. I love it. Alright, so we're gonna go with that look. Um, 
where are we gonna put the bed? I say put the, well, I could put the bed over here. Therefore, when she comes, it'll just be straight that, straight away like that. I like that, I can still keep the bookcase. Um, and now all I have to do is just get her some end tables and stuff like that to kind of go with it. I don't know, oh, no, this one. I don't know if it came with the theme. I really don't even know where I got it from. Um, let's see, this wouldn't really work. This is cute. It looks like a glass table, so I don't know if it's very fitting for a little girl. Um, we could do this. I think I like this. I know it's for the wedding, but I think it's a really good little um, addition to the room. Because it's all about little bows and all that stuff. So I think that'll work good. And she loves horses. so And she loves animals and horses and stuff. So we'll definitely keep with that. And then for her um, for her table, we'll just go with something simple. Um, oh, like a little flower pot. How cute is that? I think it's cute. Um, and knowing me, by the time you guys see this again, it'll already be changed. I'm, I'm so much... Um, I will change things in a minute. But yeah, we'll just do like a little lamp or something on one side of the bed there. Hmm. Alrighty. Um, what else should we do? Or, yeah, do I, am I liking it? I'm not liking that really. Hmm. There it is. So she has like two lit up little little flower pot lights I think that's adorable so we'll do something like that for now always can change it um, and uh, we want this little girl to kind of build up her charisma so we could do like something like this oh no that's like monkeys I forgot about that what is something else cute we could put this in the room for sure she's I love these little classical rooms where the room is just like really dainty we could do that maybe, but let me get her an end table. I love this end table. That is cute. I love it. And um, let me see. Did this come in different colors? Oh, it did. Okay, I like that. I like that look better. I like it because it's not, it's just kind of pure. I mean, it doesn't have any... You know, sometimes when you play The Sims, I want it to be where it just seems realistic. Like, they really live here. They really, you know, um, are just kind of normal people. Um, and you have clutter in your life. You're not always neat and perfect. And that's the way I like to play this. All right, guys. So, I think I'm almost done. Um, the only thing else I need to do is probably we can go ahead and put some toys in the room um, for her. Um, and I'll probably go with this castle looking this castle looking toy box we could put that in pink and we can have this kind of hanging out as such over here and I'm not gonna really I mean if you guys ever watch things like full house and stuff if you notice like they really didn't do a lot of changing of the way things were in the house and that's just kind of like the way I am like I don't want it to look you know I kind of wanted to have its own look so you won't see me doing too much where it'll look, um, where it will look a little, you know, I want it to look realistic, so, as I've said for the umpteenth time. <laughs> Alright guys, so I'm gonna go with this look, um, I might do a little bit of changes, and now that I've, okay, now, I don't even think I'm gonna change the coloring of this, I don't wanna change any of that, because I want this kind of look of, um, you know they're just kind of changing bedrooms but you know mom and dad don't really have a lot of money to be doing too much oh and look I already have the the unicorn um, looking um, photo so I think this looks good I'm not gonna change a thing I think it's a really cute room so this is going to be um, this is going to be Alana's room and um, as we go along um, we'll put some things in the room like she can like over here we can oops could put some things here yeah we'll do something like that yeah I love it I definitely love it and one more thing I definitely need to put her in somewhere where she can do her baking so now that looks good um, um, oh I could probably move this over here alrighty and then she could probably get another 
another one like her sister. Oh, they have more, do they? Mm, that's fine. We'll just get this and we'll make this rug, um, we'll make this rug pink like that. All right, cool. So this looks good. I love the way it looks. Um, is it too much closer to the door? No, it's fine. All right, so this is this is her room. Hope I haven't spent too much time. I definitely hope that you guys enjoyed what I've done. Um, yeah, so this is what Alana's room is going to look like. And then I made a little area for baby Vivian. And then outside, um, one thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to... Um, I was looking in here and I wanted to show you guys something that I had actually purchased. Um, oh, look at this doll. Well, I'll put it in later. I'm telling you, like, I'll find all this fun little stuff and I'll want to put it all in the room. This here. I'm going to put this over here and hopefully in next episode I will be able to use it. But it's a lemonade stand, guys, for little kids. So um, I will definitely have her selling lemonade. And I hear they do pretty good when you sell the lemonade from here. I, I also have the Harvest, um, harvest something. So actually Alana um, can start doing this. I don't think that she goes to school today, so... Yeah, that's cool. So I can actually... Pro what is she doing? Oh, yeah, I forgot. Like, she's actually doing that. Um, check supply, 10 stand. Yeah, so I am so excited. Oh, my God. Oh, okay, I thought that they had something that broke our broke our door back there but anyway guys i think i've done enough on this episode and i hope you guys enjoyed my gameplay i know i sure did and i'm so excited that now that the girls have grown up it has been so much fun playing today um and um yeah so i will see you all